Hello, everybody. Oh, hello. What's up? Um, we're gonna do another episode of School the Noob. Yay! Yeah. This, this time we're playing Garo, Mark of the Wolves, aka Fatal Fury, Mark of the Wolves. Um, because the first Fatal Fury game is called Garo Densetsu. Um, so I think Garo is just it's basically just Fatal Fury. You can think of it like that. Um, so I picked this game because uh, it was it came out like very like a month after the JoJo game that we played last time in arcades. Mm -hmm. um, and it's a pretty it's a pretty landmark uh, Neo Geo game. It's made by SNK. Um, and it, uh, in a lot of ways, it felt like a response to Street Fighter 3, which had come out not too long before that, um, because it was, you know, using their old property, but kind of, like, making it fresh and new and with, like, lots of frames of animation, very, like, nice-looking animation and sprites and stuff. Um, and it kind of feels like a Capcom game, too. It's hard to explain. That might not uh, mean much to you, but um, maybe you'll maybe you'll get what I'm saying uh, once we play so it. So you're saying it's going to fucking suck. Well, I mean, <laughs> I guess that's we'll see how we'll see how we feel about it. Maybe 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 it will suck. I don't know. That's the Capcom feel right there. But um, this uh, I mean, a lot of people like this game. Uh, there's a lot of, you know, the hardcore SNK fans, they think it's a really cool game. I think competitively it never really found its footing, um, mostly because, I mean, SNK games, m you know, in the U.S. at least, didn't really have much of a foothold. Um, to speak of, maybe that was part of the problem. I, th I think also, once you, like, get really good at the game, it's a little, I don't know. It's a little weird. Um, it's not like super. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Competitively, I don't know how how strong it would be to watch at like Evo or whatever. I feel like it would mm. uh, get a little stale, maybe. But I mean, that's neither here nor there. We're not going to be we're not going to be practicing to get to Evo or anything like that. We're just learning the game. Oh, well, damn. Sorry to <laughs> burst your bubble, but. Uh, so we'll we'll go ahead and jump over to the a knowledge check, I guess. Um. So I mean, in terms of my knowledge of this game. Oh, thanks, Disaster Squad. Twenty months. I fell in a ass and hurt ass. That's really cool. Uh. Anyway. <laughs> I uh. So I used to play this game like when I was first getting into fighting games, like. Uh, in the early 2000s, uh, we picked up this game for Dreamcast. It had a Dreamcast port, and um, it was like before I even had like my first arcade stick, and I was like just kind of playing fighting games. I like this game a lot. I played the Dreamcast port of it. I thought it was really cool. It was like one one of my favorite games to just like play. Um, so but you know I wasn't like that good at it. Um. So I am going to give myself, uh, we'll say, uh, C minus maybe. Oh, holy shit, bro! Um, because I've I've played it a lot, but you know, uh, uh in terms of like I haven't played a, like a whole bunch of people or competitively. I haven't played any tournaments of this, but I've seen some tournaments and I've you know played a lot of it casually. So that's where I stand. Um, mm. what about you? Well, I'm glad you asked. This game is, bro, this game is my life. Oh, like, really? I played it in the arcade every fucking day after school. I spent thousands in this fucking machine, and I mastered every single character. I am definitely giving myself a fucking A+. plus. <laughs> yeah, fucking right. <laughs> <laughs> F. F, F minus, okay, all right. Minus. That's fine. And, yeah, it's no big deal, so we'll, uh... I'll, I can show you what I know, and then what I don't know, we can maybe figure it out together, and that's what we'll do. Mm. 
Um, so yeah. Jump back over here. Um, so I, I had never even heard of this game or this series until you told me about this game. That's, that's how much I know about it. That's interesting. I think, I mean, I'm excited to show you these SNK games because I feel like, you know, you there's they're kind of a uh, something that you don't know a lot about, and it's I think it'd be fun to to show these to you, especially this one because this is like a big title, and also it's timely because just yesterday they released a new trailer, a few new trailers for the Garou sequel that they're working on. It's called Garou City of the Wolves. Oh, Shamra, holy fuck! Yeah. Um, which I mean, that's just a coincidence, really. It, they 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 premiered it at the SNK World Championships of of KOF fifteen, which mm. I was watching that, and then they showed the Garou thing. I was like, oh wow, that's cool. Um, so I mean, we, you could check that out. We could check that out later, or we could react to it on li live on stream. I don't know, whatever. Yeah, <laughs> but, let's uh, do it. Fuck it. You want to do it right now? Okay. Yeah, content. Hell yeah. Well, let's let me pull it up here. I like how the P and P. P in picture in picture of of uh Justin Wong and oh yeah uh -huh. they're like zooms in like it grows bigger <laughs> <laughs> yeah I, that was in the original video because it wanted to it wanted to gradually like because the crowd was like getting more hype as as he was like doing the whole thing mm. and then you know once he does it like it t I think it takes up the whole the full screen but yeah <laughs> I think that was the idea behind the uh the the general or the slow the slow enlargement. Hmm. Damn! I need the name of that editor. I need to hire that dude. I wonder because I don't know who edited it. I assume it was somebody on the Evo staff. I know that Seth Killian was like, um, on the microphone. He he was like talking into some something. You could hear him. He's like, Daigo. Rare footage of Daigo actually angry. Or something. Daigo with the full parry. He says something like that. Okay, here's the YouTube channel. Um, oh. Or actually, do you want me to stream it on Discord too? Yeah. Okay, I'll let's watch it there. let's do it. Let's do it that way. Let me let me capture the thing first. Let me turn up my Chrome. Me, yeah, let me turn off my yeah. music. Uh, da, da, da. where's this? Um, ba, 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 ba. Let's, let's capture the browser. It's not really ideal, but whatever. It's fine. And then let me capture, or let me uh, share it on Discord. Oh shit, Ash Crimson! Holy shit, man! Oh my god! Oh yeah, my god. yeah. Oh, I mean, I said Pogger. Oh. I said Poggers out loud, you know, in real life when I saw that. I clapped. Yeah. I, I stood up and clapped. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So let's see here. Uh, hopefully this isn't too loud, but I guess I'll mess with the volume once we get there. Uh, let's just go ahead and. And to this Katu, Katu. Yeah, it just rolls off the tongue. That's what I love about it. Bro, they're already abbreviating it. Like it's not it hasn't even come out. Like what the fuck? I thought that was weird too, frankly. I was like, why did they just I mean, I guess it's like City of the Wolves is kinda of long of a title. It wouldn't all fit there. Well, this is the announcement trailer. The full title should be in there. What the hell? Yeah. Yeah, I mean you're right. You're right about that. Imagine that being an arcade, one single machine in the middle of a dingy <laughs> ass fucking yeah. basement. Yeah, that's tempting. It's a trap, though. You know it's a trap. Hey, come on. It's the fucking Fight Club of fight games. <laughs> yeah. Gonna take you for a ride. Try to keep up. Mm. Right? Hey, that that's copyrighted. Take you for a ride is copyrighted by Capcom. That's true. Oh, damn, they got that Rev Guard and Rev Blow and Rev Arts and Rev Excel. Oh, yeah, dude. dude. Isn't that cool? Uh, I guess this is people know what the fuck that is. But that that's it? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so that was that was like the just general trailer. I, I guess they were kind of showing you some of the system mechanics and stuff. With the rev, mm -hmm. whatever. Okay, and then we'll go to the characters trailer. And it, What's interesting is they have they have English English VA which is new, 
They didn't have that for King, King of Fighters 15. <laughs> it's an English Vass. <laughs> English Vass. That's right. The sect of me. <laughs> oh shit. Hey, come on. It's Terry Bogard. You you know about him. He usually wears a red hat, but he looks different in Garo. Yeah. <laughs> He's unrecognizable there. <laughs> <laughs> There's Hotaru. She's an old character, so is this guy. Uh, Eagle Man, bitch. It's uh -huh. a fine specimen for my This is a new character. God. That, that character made me king of that. <laughs> she's she's alright. What's wrong with her? She seemed kinda of like the character zoomers are supposed to identify with. Oh. I would play as Terry because he's the coolest, but I would, I'd, I'd have to get the DLC outfit where he has his hat and red, red jacket. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, that seems like something they would do. But yeah, you have to pay just to play as the character and have them look normal. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they did the opposite of that in King Fighters 15. You can pay for the, uh, the jacket Mark of the Wolves look. I believe. Mm. Hercules? Oh. oh. Damn, is he, is he saying ground super or grand super? <laughs> ground upper, grand, grand upper. upper. <laughs> grand upper. <laughs> Oh, she's doing some ground uppers right there. Yeah, yeah. This is for you, Terry. Terry. What if this was just the game six characters or five or whatever? It's <laughs> <laughs> all you get. I don't like that font they use for City of the Wolves. That part. Not yeah. Good. It's too aerial, aerially. Yeah. So that's that's pretty cool stuff. Um, it's coming out early next year apparently. So that's three poggers. Um, I uh, one thing is of note is um, it seems like they're upping their game in terms of the effects. Like, the effects in that game, in the trailers and stuff, look pretty good. Like, the hit effects and stuff. The ones in, like... Mm -hmm. I mean, King Fighters 14 especially look really bad. In 15, they don't look great. Uh, in the new Samurai Showdown, I think, yeah, maybe they're okay. But, you know, that game's got kind of its own aesthetic. Um, but now they're looking pretty good. So maybe they're getting better at that sort of thing. Mm. The, uh, the background location, though, looks like something out of Street Fighter. So it's... In my mind, as somebody who is a big ignorant about fighting games, it, it, it looks like it's just trying to be Street Fighter V. Okay, yeah, that's yeah, that's one point. I think you're right. And also, I mean, um, the in terms of the mechanics and stuff, it kind of seems like they're really making it mechanically like Street Fighter VI. Um, but in their defense, like... You know, I, I think uh, Street Fighter Six also kind of ripped off uh, King of Fighters Thirteen. I'm mean, not really; it didn't rip it off, but like, you know, they they had the right to like do it because it started with King of Fighters Thirteen or whatever, and then Street Fighter Six maybe went their own way, and now they, they have the right to like kind of take a little bit from SF Six in return. So it's not really a big deal, but um, but I think yes, you're right. I think they're maybe trying to Street Fighter it eyes the uh, <laughs> the new. Garo title or whatever. Mm, well, I'm, I'm just saying that aesthetically, yeah. Like we, we need these fights taking on place on Mars or, you know, cra crazy ass places that aren't the same streets that the street fights are taken taken part on. I got you. I got you. Fight in in the forest. Why isn't Why isn't there a forest fight? Fight in a, yeah yeah. Fight in, in inside a volcano. <laughs> yeah, go somewhere crazy. Yeah. Um. 
I mean, the, Garou, Garou, the one we're about to play, has really nice stages that are varied. Um, so maybe maybe it's just the the one place that they've have finished so far, and you know, in, in you know, to play devil's advocate, I guess. Hmm. Um, mm -hmm. so maybe they have other stuff they're working on, but we'll see. Maybe if it's all just places like that, where it's just like some street or some like b building or warehouse or some shit like that, you know, then we can all, you know, email SNK and tell them to fuck off or whatever. They should fight inside of an arcade machine that is an older Fatal Fury game playing in the background. That won't be distracting or anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I like that idea. Oh my fuck! All, All right. right, should we start this shit? Let's do it, man. Let us do it to it. I see you. I'm gonna challenge you. Here you go. Oh my god, this dude's challenging me. What the fuck? That's right. Get ready for action. Oh my god, somebody's challenging me in the fucking JoJo room. Fuck off, God. <laughs> That's a problem with the uh, light cave. Okay, hold on. I need to do all my video settings. Uh, yeah, the problem is it's gonna time's gonna run out. But I mean, you're on Terry, so yeah, I guess so. It's fine. I'll give my big fat ass analysis of all these characters next next round. Okay. Oh, so what 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 is this? What am I picking? Okay, so top. Uh, it's, it stands for tactical offensive position or some shit like that. Um, it's you're, you're picking a space on your life bar in which you will activate top, in which you're a little stronger and you have access to like an extra move. Um, so I have it at the at the at the beginning of my life bar. You have it at the very end, and it's real, there's no real good answer of like where it should be. It's just like up to you, up to your preference. Do you want to start the match and be strong, or do you want to like end it being strong, or in the middle? I guess that's what it comes down to. Mm. Um, I think what's what's my oh yeah this is this is my to my top move. It's this thing, <laughs> which you know uh, it's not super useful, so I won't. You probably won't even use it a lot of the time, but it's just there. Um, so yeah, Terry. He's got I think he's got a fireball. If you go down to forward punch. Why? Why are you blinking? Are you? That, that's 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 top mode. When you're blinking when you're in top mode. Oh, uh, but. Oh, oh, I get it. It's at the end of mine. Yes. At the beginning of yours. Exactly. Yep. That's that's how it works. Um, okay. Kind of a, an obnoxious visual effect. A little bit, yeah. I won. Oh, hey, we're in a different place. Yeah, yeah, the stages are really good in this game. I love the backgrounds. Um, so you got, uh, that's your heavy kick. You have light punch, heavy punch, light kick, heavy kick. Um, mm. And... Uh, that's all you That's all you need. That's what I like about, like, a lot of SNK games, they have four buttons, so they're, like, really good for pad. Um, you don't have to worry about the shoulder buttons. Yeah, so... She has this, like... Uh, these are called Harrier Kicks. This is called Crazy Ivan, this move. Um, Terry has, I think, Power Wave is a uh, down a forward punch. That's Burn Knuckle. Uh, he has Crack Shoot, which is down to back and kick. Yeah. Um, he also has... Um, well, I think it's like suck, suck, suck. I think it's like back forward punch, and it, you, you you do it like three times in a row, and it's called power charge. Oh, you gotta hit start. Oh, there you go. The challenger. Okay. Oh, let's double that forward. My, okay. My initial assessment. Okay, rock. Uh, -huh. uh looks like a little gimp boy a little bit. Uh, -huh. uh, this dude looks like a fucking goof. <laughs> uh, Hotaru looks like Nakaruru. Uh -huh. Oh, time's oh. up. Well, we'll do the rest uh, later. Middle. Okay. B. Jenny. B. Yeah, what, what is with this low T announcer here? 
<laughs> well, we'll listen to when he says fight. Because then, then he gets that boost of adrenaline. Mm. Listen to this. Fight! Mm. Sounds like an intern. A little bit. Oh god, now I gotta like learn the moves. <laughs> just as I was learning Terry, holy shit. Well, it's okay. I mean, they're pretty. They're pretty simple. They're most mostly just like, you know, down to forward and or like a a shoryuken motion, like forward down down forward for some characters. Um. Also, let's see. Is it tr try down to forward and kick? Is that something? Try down to back and kick. There you go, that, that thing. So that um, every character in this game has a move that they can break. And and you say, what's a break? Okay, so it's basically uh, you hit A and B at the same time when uh, after you do the move, and it'll cancel it. So like, I, I canceled that. So that that down to back kick, you, you want to hit, yeah, there you go, yeah. So like, that, I mean, that's really, it's important if you want to like learn this game. Um, there's no reason, like, not to do that most of the time. It just, like, mm -hmm. cancels the recovery and makes it better, so. Uh, so yeah, that's your, that's your break move, is that kick. So, if you're, you know, you just want to do that whenever you're attacking me, basically. This game also has, like, short, short hops. If you, like, if you just kind of, like, tap up, you get a little, little hop. That's good for, like, offense, you know? Um, I like this little kick in the shin right there. Yeah, that is nice. Um, she has a firebolt as well, I think. There you go. Also, she have. How, how, how do you throw? Is there a throw in this? Yeah, game? it's like forward and he either heavy button. Yeah, there you go. So there's also uh, just defense, where if you tap back, like if you if you tap block right before. A move comes out, or right, you know, like right as soon as they throw it out, um, you can get. There you go, and uh, it. I think it has like less block stun, and you can also you get health back when you just defend. You can block in the air with just defense. Also, that's important for not getting anti-aired, or you know, avoiding anti-airs. Oh, you lost, fucking idiot! Oh my god! Oh my god, dude! Come on. Oh, but now I can't pick my character. God, damn. why is that a rule? <laughs> Who did that? Ooh. Well, that's that's a, that's the trouble with these old games. They have timers like on character select and stuff like that. Mm. Speaking of, you said this was a contemporary of that JoJo game, but the JoJo game came out in two two thousand what? No, it came out in ninety nine. Oh. Yeah, and this is okay. this was like a month after it in ninety nine. Like it's like October, and this is like November or something like that. I think. Remember correctly? So I was gonna say this looks like it's from the fucking nineties. Yeah. Uh, what? Oh, oh, it was Samurai Showdown Five that we were playing that came out in two thousand four or something. Yes. Uh huh. Yeah. It was like it was like Fizz of Five, I think. Bro, what the fuck? Okay, because I was thinking this came out in two thousand four, and like, damn, this, this is two thousand four. What the hell? <laughs> um. Yeah, I mean this game's pretty simple. Uh, that's what I think is nice about it. It's a good like beginner SNK title because um, there's not really too much to learn. I, I guess the supers. Um, so you ha you have like S power down there on your bar. Um, that's like a level one super, and I, most of them are like uh, a double fireball motion. So like down to forward and then down to forward again and then like punch or kick, or down to back mm. and then whatever. Um, that's like most of the super, like almost all the supers in this game. So if you, have, if you have S power, that's a level one, yeah. There you go. And then if you get, like, I'm gonna build some, some meter here, I guess. Uh, how how would I do that? I'll do this over and over again. Yeah. So and then you get P power. That's a level two. That's like giga powerful. So like, if I hit you with this, it's gonna do like a whole bunch of damage. P power and the supers are generally pretty good. Like you can kind of throw them out, and it's really not the worst idea. Look at that! Look at the background, dude. Look at the. It's so cool. Mm. It's like 3D, dude. <laughs> so cool. Okay. It's, yeah, this game has great presentation. I like 
the backgrounds, the colors, and I like the the animations that oh, yeah. they do mm -hmm. at the end of a round. Yeah. Um, there's also a universal overhead if you tap A plus B. There you go. Yeah, oh. that's, that's your overhead. Um, and if you if you are crouching and you and you do the same thing, you'll get a different move. And it's like um. It's not immediately obvious, but this is like your anti-air, basically. It's like an invincible upper body. So if you're jumping in, I can do this, and it'll hit most of the time, uh, generally. But, I mean, Terry's isn't very good, I think. But it's just something... It's like a tool everybody has. They have like a upper body invincible move like that. You're dead. Why does he say you're dead when he loses? Isn't he dead? <laughs> uh, I think Terry is not the best communicator. <laughs> he just says stuff, stuff that makes no sense most of the time. Look at this guy. It's it's Naruto, son of Baruto. Oh yeah. Okay. So, you, oh, you can if I if I win again, you can hover over the characters. <laughs> oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can get a yeah. We should do that next time, or whenever somebody loses, I guess. What, what do I have? A little fox jumping around? That's uh... yeah, yeah. You got some kind of furry little friend. Bro, we're holding up traffic. What the fuck? <laughs> it's a really crowded street. Um, yeah, I don't know. There's not too much else to get into, really. That was bullshit. That was fucking bullshit, bro. <laughs> Look at his run. He's like, Hi, I'm happy ninja boy. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, you got that pee. I peed all over you with my pee power. <laughs> no. Oh, he's a double jump. That's tight. What the hell was that? Fucking earthquake? <laughs> yeah. It just means that you fell really far distance. It's just trying to sell the impact of the fall, maybe. Oh, uh, I'm not... I'm not sure who fell. I was just like... It's like, Brody, oh my god. Oh, oh, decent nuts, bro. Okay, let's look at the let's look at the other characters. Okay. So we s we've got here. So this, yeah, Marco's next. All right, he's whatever. He's he's like goofy goofy guy. Baruto. It's like <laughs> the Kevin's. Bro, like how many blonde dudes can you have in a fucking game? <laughs> That's true. There's a, there's a lot. Kevin. Kevin. Ryan. <sighs> the dude's name is fucking Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> Lamest fucking name ever. Dude, this guy is like OP. He's like really good mm. in this game. I, I'm not gonna be able to pull off, pull off anything that he can do. He's he's a little difficult, but it's mostly like uh that move right there because that's that's his break move and it hits low. Which one? Uh. Nah. Yeah, this like low trip. Cause he can combo into like this thing, um, for like big damage. I think I don't know how to do it actually, but you can you can like do stuff like that, and he can also build meter really easily by like can't like canceling this thing. What is what is it supposed to be? Um, it's like it's just like an elbow, uh, and you can charge it. It does like a shitload of damage if you charge it. Is he banned? No, he's not banned. He's apparently he's not as good as Pet Shop is, um, <laughs> <laughs> but um, 
What else does he have? I think it's a grab. Is that a grab? Oh wait, that's not it. Oh, it's a, it's, it's a half circle. I think it's a command grab or something. Um, and he's got this like anti-air <laughs> thing. That's good in combos. I love how how he, big buff white dude, and then he has this really gimpy male Japanese voice. <laughs> Oh, check this oh, out. Oh, damn. This, this is the Straight best. The dick. This is the best super in the game. Watch this. It's just like a, a explosive kick. It hits like five <laughs> times, but it's really good. It's like it's like you can't punish it. You can just throw it out and there's nothing you can do about it. Mm, it's well, like I guess he belongs in that fucking JoJo game. I guess so. Yeah. Oh. Oh my god, I lost. What the hell's happening? You can finally pick a new character. Okay. Uh, free man? Oh my god, that, that's a Street Fighter 3 character. Uh -huh. The Griffin, I mean, he's, he's different. Whatever. B. J Jeanette, she's the girl. Uh -huh. uh, Gato, he's the like the Chinese monk guy mm -hmm. that, that you gotta have in your fucking game. Mm -hmm. And then, I think it's Terry at the very end, and then one more person I have to give my assessment of. Oh yeah, there's, there's actually, you, there's two boss characters you can play as as well that are not banned. Um, we should... I'll try to get those guys to. I, I, they're probably. I think you might be able to pick them if you go off screen or something. Um, Gato's pretty cool. He's. I think he's pretty strong as well. He's got that flip, and if you press a button in the air when you do the flip, yeah, you do. You do like four different things. You can slide. You can dive kick. You can uh, do like a palm air strike or whatever. Mm. Um, That's kind of cool. Yeah, yeah, yes. he's cool. Yeah. Because th then they won't know what you're, what you're up to. You could just, do yeah, nothing too. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, I think he's got. If you do like, uh, forward down down forward kick, I think that's a move. Yeah, there you go. Oh, it's like a it's like a dragon punch kick kind of, a anti air kick move. Yeah. Um, the, uh, the particle effect when you inflict damage is kind of cool. It's a rainbowy crystal kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I do like that. that. It's like breaking glass and it's rainbowy. Yeah, it does look cool. Uh, I guess like interestingly, like if you tap, like or tap forward, forward and hold it. Yeah, see, your character has a run. If I do it, I have a, like a dash. It, it, it like ends, but you can you can do yours like indefinitely. So it's just like different depending on which character you have. Um, also, you can backdash, and backdashes are invincible. I think maybe from frame one. So if you're like under pressure, you can kind of backdash and maybe like on wake up and maybe get out of uh, pressure and stuff. Oh, speaking of pressure, P, how do I do my PP? Pee -pee? Oh, pee -pee? try like down to forward twice and punch. And uh, pr press heavy punch when you do it. Yeah, see, oh. it depends on which which one you press. If you do if you do light punch, you'll get the level one. If you do heavy punch, you'll get the level two. When you have P power. Oh, sorry. What the fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> he, was, he was about to show off his like cool back scars or whatever. I, I skipped it accidentally, but. Uh, oh. It's like he was flashing the background. Yeah, so there's, there's this guy too. Jay Hoon. He looks like Gimpy Ryu. Yeah, and then there's Terry. So, best characters Terry, B, and Nakaruru. And that's it. Okay. I guess this guy's pretty good too. Oh, Gato? Yeah. Yeah, even, even though he has a stupid name and <laughs> he, he, he's like an archetype. Mm hmm. Oh, oh, I, I am, I am Asian guy, Asian monk guy, <laughs> and then free man. Oh my god! Yeah. Fucking names and fucking. Oh my god! See that that costume he was wearing would have been cooler than this stupid shit he's wearing now. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of with you. I don't really like Freeman very much. Also, he sucks. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, I, I mean, I don't even know how to play him really. I think he has, he's got records with this thing. What else does he have? That thing, I don't know what that is. This thing. Uh, you know what? It, it's like fighting games in the late '90s all had to have a character that looks like the crow. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That is what it's like. 
Yeah, bro, check me out. Check me out, bro. Oh. <laughs> oh man, what happens when two gatos run at each other? Holy shit. Oh like, yeah. The world would explode. Yeah. Like it's like an immovable object versus whatever. <laughs> oh, what, what is it? Da down down to forward punch? Yeah, down to forward twice and punch or kick, I believe we'll get you a super oh let me build up some meter Hold yeah on. yeah oh. okay let's see so down to forward twice oh shit oh oh damn i'm ripping your fucking head off bitch oh my god oh yeah that's just tight dude nice and i think he's got one with kick that's like an anti-air like upward rising kick thing Is there ever a super in a game where it, it takes three bars or four bars or some, something crazy that you'd have to save up for, but if it lands, it's instant death for the other person? Um, yes, that's, that's definitely been done before. I'm trying to think of an example. I think um, Android 16 and like DBFZ, I think it's got some kind of like explosion. There it is. There's the scars. Mm. Yeah, like, I think Android 16 has something like that. I'm sure there's other characters, too. That's, that's the one that comes to mind. So, let me, I think, uh, how do you do this? Let's see. You hold start, and you go, like, up, up, down, down. Oh, there, there it is. There was the guy. You have to hold oh, start. Oh, you have to land on him? Well, no, you have to hold start on either Dong Juan or Jaehoon, and then... You go like up, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, or something like that, and you can pick the the boss characters. Um, but we'll we'll get to them eventually. But they're, they're pretty good too. The boss characters are also top tier, from what I understand. I think I think Otaru is related to Gato. I think they're like siblings or something, or maybe like I don't know. I feel like they're related, but I'm not sure. Yeah, the resemblance is uncanny. Also, your name has Futa in it. Come on, dude. That's... <laughs> That's just silly. Yeah, these backgrounds are good, and I like that they're... It's not that they're mono-colored, but it, it, they're colored in a way where it's not distracting and we're typically bright colors that separate us from the background right i guess you could maybe say the colors are muted or drab but they're they're not they're they're just not obnoxious which i like damn bro what are you doing to your brother <laughs> all right so huh? yeah that's supers people like to say that that's like an orgasm super <laughs> which you know i guess it could it does look like that Actually, I actually used Hotaru. She was in uh, Neo Geo Battle Coliseum. I didn't play too much of that game, but I played like once or twice with like a friend. I, I played Hotaru and uh, Marco from Metal Slug. That, that was my team. Oh, Metal Slug ain't even a fighting game. Well, he was in that, that fighting game, so you know what? Now it's a fighting game. That's how it works. Oh, see, there's even a, a glass shattering sound effect when when you die. Right. It works. It works because it's a fighting game and you're That's, beating the shit out of yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Focus, the focus is on that impact. Oh, what? What the <laughs> fuck is going on? Oh, you have to press start again. Oh, I need to press start. Yeah. And. Oh, it's different every time. Oh, that's interesting. So the random select is random every time. Cool. And this this character, Hokuto Maru, I don't know too much. I think he has too much lore or like his backstory. But I think he's the student of like Andy Bogard, who's like the ninja Bogard brother. Uh, it might he may also be the son of like Andy and Mai. 
Because I think he has some of my moves as well. Bro, oh, he's a fucking stupid little ninja kid. Hey, he's cool. Oh, yeah! Oh, that was bullshit. My kick should have stopped your super. <laughs> Perhaps. Another, one thing in this game that... Um, is it, it? I'm drinking water. Oh, sorry. Oh, I mean, you can talk. Don't don't be cheating getting in some hits, bro. Like, um, so in a lot of SNK games, you can um, cancel your back dash because it's airborne, and you can cancel it into an air move. So, like, this guy can do, like, these air shuriken, so you can cancel his back dash into a shuriken. Um, not everybody has, like, air moves like that, but a lot of, a lot of characters, or some characters can. And that, that's, like, a lot of King of Fighters games have the same, like, properties. Something interesting you can do. Sounds like the same. Fuck you. Bitch. <laughs> yeah, Terry's tight. Oh my god. Oh, suck it. Suck it, bro. Damn it. You're you're dead or or whatever he says that's made no sense. Oh my god, I was trying to pull off my fucking key shit. <laughs> da it, it, wait, it's down to forward or forward to down? For or it's down to forward twice. Down to forward. Yeah, Bro, most of the time. That's what I was doing, like what the fuck. I'll try harder. <laughs> Do it better next time. Mm. But, oh, I, I keep forgetting about that. You gotta set your top, bro. Bro, it, it don't even fucking matter. <laughs> I like how he flips his shirt on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's getting ready, you know. He 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 was maybe you know he was taking a bath and then he he's just getting dressed for the fight, you know. Mm. Yo, hold up, I gotta go to the bathroom. Alright. That face when you have to take a piss and you just spent a quarter and then you wasted like half of twenty five cents. Yeah. <laughs> there's there's no worse feeling than that. That that's something you have to add to this this layout is mm. is a quarters wasted. Oh yeah. Either like a count of the quarters or um, maybe there's some way to increment a text element in OBS by twenty five or, or whatever. You know. Uh -huh. I think there might be, and then get the formatting in in money money amounts with the dollar sign. Mm. That'd be pretty cool. You put a little quarter icon next to it. Yeah, that would be cool, actually. That's a good idea. I like that. And it has to put, play a little quarter insertion sound effect. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Oh, bro. Oh, you can't even defeat my Shen Long, alright? So don't even try. <laughs> Oh, bro, I was about to do my kickflip. What the hell? You can't do your kickflip on me. Oh. No! Kick! Oh. Penis power. Oh, it's, it's midday now. Yeah, I, I like the, the way the backgrounds change too over time. That's cool. Oh, fuck. Live wire!
Oh fuck, that a lot of damage. Oh. Well, how how come I was able to run as as Terry? Well, it's just different for every character. Uh, like Terry oh. has Terry has a run, Gato has a run, Kevin has a dash. Uh, okay. Jenna, I think she has a dash. If I'm not mistaken. Hmm. But everybody's back dash is a dash. Exactly. Yeah, and it's like okay. air, considered airborne. Uh, pretty sure for like every character, as far as I know. Oh, even blonde girl. Oh my! Is there enough blonde fucking people in this game? Holy shit! <laughs> yeah. So Janae's like a pirate, and this is this is like what her the fuck is going on in the background. <laughs> I mean, I, I couldn't tell you really, but there's some pirate shenanigans going on. Poor people. All right. What 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 is the little heart you throw out at me? Is that is that does that hurt me? Uh, oh. I don't believe so. It's just, it's just like a, her dash. And she sparkles when she dashes mm -hmm. forward. She's a very, kind of, uh... Oh, oh, what's going on here? Wacky character. Two dudes holding on to South, South Marine Club. Something like that. Oh, bro. I think maybe coloring the character like Samurai Showdown does would be... Less weird looking than me flickering when you're in the the top top or whatever the hell it's called. Uh huh. Oh, I do like how my my win marker is is a star, but I remember it was a fist for somebody else. Like yeah. That unique thing. They do have neat icons that are that are unique for every character. Oh, also, I forgot about this. Okay, so it's not really that important for us, but like, so there's also faint attacks, and you and uh, so if you if you press like, if you hold down and press A plus C or both punches, actually, sorry, you pre you press down plus A plus C all at the same time. Oh, what, what what's? But like both punches and down together. You do that. Yeah, there you go, there you go. It's a feint. It's like a fake out. You can also do forward. Forward plus both punches, and it'll get, it'll get a different feint. God, it's fucking hard to pull off. It is, yeah. That's... That? What? Yeah, that? so... And it's, it's like... So... So... So block for me? Like, block and hold back and, uh, let me... Like, you can kind of, like... Get some, like, ghetto, like, pressure if you just, like... Cancel you into faint like over and over, and and there's a guard break in this game too. So if you do it enough times, like you, you can get a combo mm. like that. Oh, uh, actually, it's called a guard crush. You fucking noob. Oh, sorry. Is the noob here? Yeah. <laughs> so, but yeah, like the uh, I I watched the uh, the Evo Japan tournament of this. I think they had they had this on a uh, tournament for this. Um. And the, there was a Janae player who won, and he was doing that on pad. He was like, perfectly like canceling like heavy punch into the dash or the feint, and then dash like over and over. And it's like a guard infinite, basically. So it's pretty hard to do. Um, well, that's bullshit, bro. Yeah. That's bullshit. I know. Yeah, this game has a lot of bullshit. <laughs> Victory. Hey, you. Fuck you. That's what she's saying. <laughs> All right, let's see. I need to pick somebody, somebody new. How about? Oh, uh, I'll try Kevin now. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'll figure your top. Kevin Ryan. Oh, the uh, the guy who was doing the the Janae shenanigans. Uh huh. What position was his top? In. I believe he had it at the end of his life bar. Mm. That's I think that's what most like, either most people either put it at the beginning or the end. I'm and I believe he had it at the end, but I could be wrong. 
<laughs> hey, press a button when you do that. You, you can do a, a, a yeah. You can do different things out of that too. That's like a low. Oh, so it's it's like Gato's flippy thing. Exactly, and uh, he has like an overhead. I think one, one of them's overhead. I think you can cancel it. There's there's overhead. Oh, there. Yeah. And then that that move with circle does nothing. So that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, so what's his? I love how he hums when he does. He's like, <laughs> this dude is a fucking JoJo character. <laughs> kind of, yeah. Oh, oh, oh juke to oh, fuck. oh, 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 faked him out, bro. Flash in your ass, and then it was back, back, back in there. No, forward. And, there's forward and down. Those are your two feints and, and both oh. punches. Oh, there. I don't know why it's so hard to pull off. Yeah. <laughs> Bro. And so, how many of these characters are in King of Fighters 15? Um, just Gato, uh, Rock, and Bijane. Uh, I think. Oh, I guess Terry's in there too. Oh, you know what? Actually, I mean, t not in there. Or, sorry, the Griffin is not in there, but there's a character called King of Dinosaurs who's essentially the same character. Or supposed to be the same person, I think. So technically he's in there too, I guess. You want to get real real anal about it. Hmm. Oh, shit. Oh, upskirt, upskirt. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> her... Her shit kind of makes me think of my... Yeah, yeah. Um, she she kind of fills that uh, that gap of having like the sexy female fighter, but my son yeah, in this game. My, uh, there's only two girls in this game, bro. What the hell? There we go. So the, the, this Holy is one of the shit. this is one of the boss characters, Grant. He's a fucking asshole if you fight him as a as a AI like CPU opponent. He's like. The hardest boss you'll ever fight in any game. <laughs> it's really stupid. Round one. Why does every boss character have to be some big fucking buff dude who's the spawn of Satan and so <laughs> bad and big and awesome? And well, can it be uh, you know a little girl or something? <laughs> well, I'm sure that's happened before, but we'll have to. We'll have to. Oh damn! Damn, nice. Kicking Satan in the nuts, bro. There, there is another boss character who's not like a big buff guy, so maybe, maybe he'll change your mind. But, you know, we'll see about that, I guess. I, I guess it's not that they have to be buff, but they're always some, some force of nature that that could destroy the fucking world because they they contain so much power and and oh. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm, uh, uh. Well, I mean, it, if you're making a boss character, they have to be strong, right? Like they have to be threatening. Right? Maybe they're they're so uh, self assured and confident in themselves that they don't need to be flexing and have a fucking dungeon of fire to show that they're a badass. They're like they're a chill boss, and you fight them and they kick your ass, and mm -hmm. uh, they say like like good good job trying. Try again. <laughs> okay, I miss, that's interesting. <laughs> that, could, that, that could work, I guess. Like, he got M. Bison, he's a big buff. Oh, I'm fucking evil and I'm gonna take over the world and fuck you. I kicked your ass and now the world has ended because of your failure. Mm -hmm. It's like, okay, bro, like, <laughs> you can calm the fuck down. Yeah, it's not that serious, man. Let me do my pee on you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bam! Oh! Oh, what was the explosive kick? The S, the S power? Uh, no, no, no. That's that's like with kick instead of punch. Uh, the same like down to forward twice motion though. Oh, oh, oh. So there's there's four different. So is there there are four different P's that? No, no, no. Because the the light is you're doing one rank of the the shit. Yeah. And, oh. So you have, you have a punch and a kick super generally like, 
And so it's, it's down to four with each one, and then there's an S and a P version of, of both supers. So four supers total, uh, and two there's two two kinds of supers and two strengths, and so you have four total, I guess, is the thing. Bro, this crawl builds fucking major. I know, dude. Yeah. That's and that's like the old game mentality. Like, <laughs> moves don't do that in fighting games anymore. Generally, they don't, you can't just like do whiff moves and build meter anymore because that's lame as fuck. Hmm. Yeah, I'm fucking Satan, bro. I fucking kick man. Why does the demo start with the boss, dude? Shouldn't he be revealed in in, in the game or, or something? Hmm. Like you're spoiling the boss right there in the first fucking demo screen. Well, maybe you're right. Yeah, maybe they maybe they really screwed the pooch on that one. Well, I guess you said there was another boss boss dude. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, I guess there's that. Like, it's not they're not completely spoiling the game. Yeah. So Rock, his name is Rock Howard. Are you familiar with the character Geese? Geese Howard. I've heard of the name, but I don't know what he looks like. I'm guessing okay. he's a blonde dude, isn't well, he? Well, yeah, he's a good, that's a good guess. Um, this is the... I think he's the son of... This is the son of Geese, and he's been raised by Terry. So he has some of Geese's moves and some of Terry's moves. Bro, why, um, why is everybody the son or the daughter of, of someone? Like, bro, damn. that's how anime works, dude. You have a lineage. Anime works. <laughs> yes. It's like JoJo, right? Like, JoJo is just the lineage of all the JoJos, you know? Mm. And Dio as well. That's his counter. He has crack counter. Um, he has um, there you go. He has like hard edge. Yeah, it's like down to back and punch. I think it's like a dashing kind of elbow. He's got a uh, ground wave fireball down to forward. Bro, I just kicked the devil's ass like. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, I think he also, has. This dude looks way fucking out of place in a fucking parking lot. Like, come on, dude. <laughs> Go back to Party City. Holy shit. Dude, come on. I'm Satan, bro. You have to respect me. Um, I think if you hold down and then press up and punch, he has a rising tackle. That's like your anti air, I think. I think he, I don't know if that's his break move. I think you can break that one if you if you feel like it. I don't remember what break is. I don't even remember what break. Oh, like it's it does or is more. A plus B when you when you do your move, but I mean whatever. You don't have to. Oh uh, wait, a, which button is B? Is it triangle? Uh no, it's um square and X together. Oh, um, I killed the devil in a parking lot. That's how that's how strong look at the wings, dude. He's so powerful. <laughs> he, he plays alright, but mm -hmm. he, he's less cool Terry. Yeah. See, here's the other oh, boss. Shit. His name is Kine R Heinlein. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> But this is the the other kind of stereotypical. Like, Ooh, I am rich and and bad guy. I am so rich and powerful, and yeah, two fucking pigeons on my goddamn stoop. Also, also oh, blonde. More back there. Also blonde. He's also blonde. So yes. Yeah. Guys, the Americans. They are all blonde, blonde and white skinned. They will like this game. This will do well in America. <laughs> We have blonde white woman in background of stage. I think that's his like wife or mother or some shit. I forget the story. Um, what else does he do? I think he just has like fireball and uppercut pretty much. I can't remember if he has any other moves. His his supers are pretty broken. Uh, oh, that's something. It's the other one. That's good. So we can build meter. Mm, I need to do moves. What, what the hell is his name? Kine R. Heinlein. Yeah, dude. He's epic. Bro. This is the good super. 
<laughs> it's like a it, it's a fireball that just hits so many times you have to you have to like deal with it you have to block it and he just like fucks you up while, while it's hitting i like the bass boosted sound effect that accompanied it yeah it's pretty tight <laughs> holy shit <laughs> You gonna, try, you gonna try your rock supers? Mm, yeah. Um. Yeah, he's got double fireball punch and kick. I think he has, a, he has another one too. He has a deadly rave. Oh my god, what the fuck am I doing wrong? Wow. He hurt, he hurt his hand. He, that's how Artie was fighting. Why? Why? Yes. There you go. Damn. That was tight. Huh. <laughs> I love looking at everybody's light kick. Because it's some little, little wimpy ass kick. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. We got a follower. Thank you. Oh, my God. Oh, so holy shit. Souls I wrote. Thank you for the follow. Hawkers. Your follower number 100. <laughs> Been waiting for number 100 for a while. But thank you. That means I'm going to have to play Dark Souls now. Bro, that ain't a fighting game. Well, that's true. I got, I'm not going to play it on on this particular program. <laughs> Until we do. Like yeah. Dark Souls PvP as a fighting game. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Getting ready for City of the Wolves? You know it, dude. That's right. Mm -hmm. We saw that hype trailer. Or trailers, rather. Poggers. So, I think... My favorite character... <laughs> oh, Pre... Pre... Preacher. 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 <laughs> oh, God. You know, like... Oh. She's pretty tight. She, no, um... She's... she's like, uh... She seems like she might be... Have some of Joe's moves. Is Joe's a, a Muay Thai fighter as well from uh, SNK games, King of Fighters and stuff. Uh, so Kim, there's Kim Dong Hwan and Kim Jae Hoon. I I forget it's like just students of Kim or there's a character called Kim Kap Hwan who's uh, like Taekwondo I think. Um, and these are these are these guys are related to him in some way. Mm. So they're just kind of you know. I like the girl walking around back there like a fucking Disney mascot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's he's drumming up business for the casino. Mm. The okay, like like I see the background mm. and and all the people have a yellow tint to them. Oh yeah. So it all kind of blends together. It makes sense mm -hmm. light lighting wise. Mm -hmm. But that make makes it easy to separate us who are in the spotlight and colored Versus them in the background, darker and mm. tinted, and I like that. Yeah, yeah, I like that as well. The nice touch. And anything that that that's super visually distracting is more towards the top of the screen, like the casino sign and then the the purple neon behind that. Uh huh. So I I appreciate that. I do like that as well. I do like a dive kick too. I think you could do like multiple hits on it too. Oh, they're Kim's sons. Okay, yeah, I I, I didn't watch the the Justin Wong video, but I, I heard that he put up a video about the about the uh, City of the Wolves. Bro, what the hell does he know, man? Like, bro, <laughs> you, you don't know shit. Bro, you need that King Dolce analysis of the trailer. <laughs> well, we got it now. We can we can <laughs> upload that shit. <laughs> Me complaining about the text, the font, <laughs> the, the, font City of the, Wolves. the font's too aerial. <laughs> the, uh, the official complaint. Oh, I guess it's random who they show in the demo. Never mind. All right, who am I gonna pick this time? I'll try. I'm, I'm gonna try Freeman and regret it immediately. <laughs> oh, you got the cool color with the white hair. Yeah, it's more appetizing than the orange hair. Yeah. Oh, it's oh my god. Yeah, dead footage, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I, I don't like Preacha because she's uh, she's a trend now where they got to include like a, a streamer zoomer character. <laughs> all, all the zoomers. It's like they zoomerified Julia from uh, Tekken. Yeah. That was Tekken 7. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, that's kind of cool because it's a returning character, but it's, it's like the bar. I'm surprised this, this free man dude isn't barefoot just to make him even more fucking <laughs> That's all he's missing, really. It's just taking off his shoes. Who, who's that dude from Street Fighter 3 who looks like this fucking sulking carrot? Oh, um, uh, Remy. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. He's my favorite character. Oh, he's cool, yeah. And I also make stupid noises, too, so that, oh man, this character is so good. <laughs> What's not to like? Oh, oh, I fail. Oh, my God. I'm the fucking crow, bro. <laughs> that has to be it. Every fucking Japanese game developer making fighting games watched the crow and was like, oh, shit, we need that dude in our fucking game, but we can't get the rights to him, so let's... Make somebody who's all fucking crestfallen and, and emo looking. <laughs> yeah, he, he is kind of like mature from KOF. He's got like the same kind of like slashes, recas and stuff. The uh, hold on, let me let me do my P P on you. Uh, oh, I think it's a counter <laughs> or something. Oh, yeah. That's Fucking great. Maybe, yeah, because you used up all your meter and then nothing happened. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, I'm gonna fucking nudge them to death. Slap that knee, D Dong Juan. This Don Dong Juan is that like Don Juan, like a play on that? Maybe. He he's he's like the silly Sho Shoto Shoto Shoto. Is yeah. that what they're called? Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah, he's like a, the silly Shoto, like, Dan, I, oh. I believe, the pink dude. Yeah, yeah. That's what he is. And then Jay hoon is, is like, the serious one. Yeah, he's like the he Ryu. He takes his training seriously. Yeah. yeah, like the Ryu. He's like, bro, do not disrespect our master, or I'm gonna <laughs> kick your ass. <laughs> and then Wang over there is like, yo, man, it's like, yo, whatever. Like, bro, like, you know, shit, yeah. it ain't even nothing. Yeah. They're fucking karate dudes. Yeah. Fighting in front of a fucking hot dog stand, all right? Oh, these are like our classmates back here. That's what's going on. Nice faint right there. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, 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 you think I'm gonna do something, but I'm actually not. So, <laughs> you're an idiot, bro. Let, let me guess, I have a fucking Hadouken. Oh. Nah, yeah, these guys are just like kicks. They have various, like, kick moves. Some have, like, like Jaehoon's have some fire effects, and Dong Huan's have, like, lightning. Um, and they got, like, an overhead kind of thing. This guy has a dive kick. Oh, he's got, like, a counter, or, like, a guard Ooh, point move. That's kind of cool. What else? I'm gonna try, like, one of his supers. Uh, let's see. Oops. Time up! Uh -oh. Oh, he's got a drink. Oh, let me get a, get a drink of that. <laughs> <laughs> that was a weird clap. Am I, what, am, what am I doing wrong with these supers that I can't fucking do them? It's tough to say. Maybe, like, try it faster a little bit. Try the motion a little bit faster. Make sure you're hitting all the all the important, like, inputs. Like, you're doing the full down, down, forward, forward. Kind of motion both times. Bro, what were you saying about this game's good for pad and then it's like not even <laughs> like Damn. Mm -hmm. Maybe I was wrong. Yeah, that dude dude is eating beans in the fucking corner. Yeah. They're good. Like a fuck. Maybe he's a vegan. <laughs> or I guess they were noodles. Oh upon yeah. Upon second inspection. Yeah, yeah. The Griffin. The, the Griffin? <laughs> it's him. It's the Griffin. I forget what this guy does. I, I never really played this guy before. It oh, reminds shit. me of Frank, 
Frank he he Hank Freebird from Trauma Team. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. oh, I'm a fucking bird, man. Oh my god, bro. What the fuck? Oh, damn. Oh, well, now we're in a wrestling ring. Does it... <laughs> Does it take into consideration who we pick and then put us in a relevant yes. uh, arena? Yes. Battle? It's like their stage. This is this is t -Zox, or sorry, the Griffin's stage. Um. Yeah, it, it's whoever is like the challenger uh, is gonna it's gonna be their stage, I think. Oh, oh my suck. T Sock straight up broken in City of the Wolves, really. Is he using that Rev XL? Hmm. I'm using that Rev Lawn. Hell yeah! Nice, dude. That's tight. I'm using that that Rev A ROM for uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it makes me think of when I say, when I hear Rev. I, I think of revision. Like that. Dun, dun, dun. What? The, you know what they, uh... I like my little fire emblem for the uh, victory counter. Yeah, it's like an emoji. Yeah. Dude does a fucking fire, explosive fire splits into your fucking face. <laughs> I guess the the two brothers are fine, just because you need the Shoto in your fucking game. Because every fucking game needs a Shoto. So I, I would I would not um, exterminate them from existence if I were <laughs> <laughs> recreating this game in my image. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, yeah, I guess that's important too. Who who I would axe from the game. Mm -hmm. So I need to do that next. Uh, time I lose. Okay. Just make sure I lose this time, bro. Like goddamn. I'll get you. I'm gonna kick your ass with Tzok. Oh damn! Falcon smash! Holy! Oh my god! Okay, I'm glad you confirmed my my suspicions about the arenas being picked for somebody because I was noticing that. Yeah. Like, what, what are the odds? Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Oh. Wow. Oh my God, bro. Actually, SMK rules, and I was wrong about them. All this time. <laughs> That's how. Because <laughs> when I first started getting into fighting games, I, I played them with a friend I met in high school, and he was into fighting games. I wasn't really into them as much. Um, but he knew about like King of Fighters and stuff, and I, I didn't know anything about it. And so mm. I kind of got into it through him. Although I wasn't like a huge SNK fan when I started playing fighting games, but I, I just I thought it was cool to like get introduced to that side of games I never really knew about. Okay, get rid of Freeman, and then the, this <laughs> this set of characters is fine. Okay. What's funny about Mark? So this is Marco Rodriguez. He's also uh he's a Kyokugan fighter, which is kind of like a Shoto. Basically, he has a fireball uppercut, sort of thing. Um, but what's funny about him is when they localized this game, they changed his name for some reason. I don't know if there was like a copyright infringement thing or whatever, but his name is in the English version is Kushnude Butt. B U T T is his last name. <laughs> So, yeah, his name is fucking Butt. That's why. That's why he's tight. <laughs> Kush nude. Kush butt. nude butt. <laughs> I don't know why they went with that, you know, but that's what they called him. I like this background. It's it's in the woods, like like I was saying. You need. To yeah. Yeah. You need more variety. You can't you can't fight in the streets all the fucking time. Yeah, exactly. So I'm guessing this is Marco's uh, stage. Yes. Yep. There is. I like his stone uh, barbell back there. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. All the animals Yo, too. Yo, the bear bear is eating his cornflakes, bro. Oh Dude, he's hungry. He's eating all the porridge. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, 
Hadouken. And I like how it, it's all... I guess maybe it's that all the stages follow some sort of color palette that oh, isn't yeah. too obtrusive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they're all they're all they're varied and they look good, but but your characters definitely stand out, which is also good. Like it's what you want. So they're desi yeah. designed well and they're like practical. <laughs> yeah, I, I think maybe. There might be a character with one color palette that that doesn't work on a particular stage, but mm -hmm. I haven't found any. I haven't lost visual tracking of any character. Like your your green on this green is is a little bad, but it's not too bad because half of you is bright orange. Right. Yeah. Oh, there, oh, there, oh, there, oh. <laughs> oh uh, let, let me do a pee on you. Oh, okay. If I can fucking pull it off, gee. There you go. Oh, there we go. Yeah, first try, bro. Nice. I think uh, Marco has an, has a hidden super as well. I forgot how to do it. I think it's like I think it's like triple fireball motion, and then I don't know what button you press, but he can, can do. He has some kind of hidden super. But but now it's time for my P. Oh. Oh. Sh oh, damn. P. Ness. Right there. Yeah. Damn it. <laughs> oh, oh, damn. Yeah, this is my sign, bitch. Oh, All right. shit. This, what are you doing in my swamp? <laughs> Donkey. <laughs> what are you doing in my swamp? <laughs> oh, shit. Butt on butt action? Oh, That's right. God. The double butt. Marco Rodriguez versus Marco Rodriguez. <laughs> yeah, I love the, like, the exact same like cadence. Why does he... he doesn't need a last name? Just call him Marco or, or Kush Butt. He doesn't, he doesn't need the last name, okay? It adds nothing to his character. Does, does Ryu have a last name? No. Does Chun Li have a last name? No. Ken has a last name, but the game doesn't mention it. He's just called Ken on the fucking fighter select, okay? We don't need these full fucking government names for our fighting game characters. Oh, bro, I'm getting confused who, which butt belongs to who. Yeah, it's tricky. I'm, I'm the one that, that got arrested and went to prison. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so so is this like the? It's down to back and and kick. That's not a damaging move. That's just a closing the gap. It seems like it, yeah. But he also has the uh, the he does have a, he has a kick move. You did you did it last round. I forget how to what the motion is for that. Yeah, that thing. Yeah, yeah. What is that? Oh, I, I think. Down to for, down to forward. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. His name is Ryu Streets. <laughs> <laughs> we need to do Fighting Street next. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's a classic. Is that two player? Yeah, that's two player, isn't it? But yeah, you can play two player. It's just Ken versus Ryu. I yeah. Think. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh damn! <laughs> damn, <laughs> damn, dude, sure you can my asshole. See, he he can break his his uh dragon punch, so that's pretty tight. <laughs> that's like a that's a novel idea for a character being able to break his dragon punch. Oh, <laughs> what are you doing? Nothing. In my fucking swamp, bro. What are you doing in my swamp? Oh, there should be a secret character where you play as that that bunny girl walking around in the back of that one stage. Oh yeah, yeah. She'd be popular. Uh, for some reason, I feel like Jin A isn't really as popular as like my, because like I play a lot of King of Fighters 15, and then I play Jin A, and she's like one of my favorite characters in that game. Just I like the way that she plays, but um. Once she once she got nerfed and she became slightly less than top tier, like everyone dropped her. I don't see I don't see anybody play Janae at all. It's weird. Thanks for the follow, Daimao Koopa. 
appreciate Bro, it. Bro, it's because she's a big hoe. <laughs> I mean, people seem to hate her. I don't know why. I think it's like, she's just kind of goofy of, of a character. I'm not sure, but... I get the vibe that people don't really like her as much. So yeah, she's got a down to back punch, down to forward punch. Yeah, she had a little little whirlwind. Um, if you jump in the air and press down and kick multiple times, you get like the the kicks. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> um, <laughs> she's got a down to forward kick is her break move. It's like a it's uh, it's called the hind. It doesn't really have much of a... It's just kind of a combo move. You just throw it in there. Um, yeah. She's got down to back and kick. It's like a crack shoot kind of overhead thing. Bro, she thinks she fucking Peter Pan over here? Pirate flies, throws out little Tinkerbell sparkles. <laughs> oh. You never heard of someone hanging on her? Maybe it's, maybe it's just me. <laughs> I just feel like I don't see any Gen A players on King of Fighters 15. That's the that's the, my main uh, observation, I guess. Like I don't see any Gen A players online. But because I'm not online, bro. Maybe it's just King, maybe it's just King of Fighters players that that are hating on her. They maybe they're just like they just love all the other characters more. Like everyone loves the Ashiro and you know those guys more than Gen A. Everyone loves the King of Dinosaurs already. <laughs> people, love, yeah, people do love that guy. I see a lot more King of Dinosaurs than I do Janae, and he's not even that good. He's like pretty bad in the game. <laughs> oh, <it's> denied, <laughs> son. I think that was a secret super. So what? What? What was different about it? I mean, I mean, I think it's just. I mean, it's not listed. Or something. I, I think it's just not in the move list or something like that. That's why they call it secret. But it's just like down to forward three times and then fierce punch or something. Oh, three times. Yeah, instead, instead of two. Exactly, instead of twice. Something like that. Hmm. Oh, well, sure. isn't he a special boy that he gets another super? Yeah. He is. Da, 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 da. Oh, shit. Pink rock, bro. That's kind of a cool color. This is not blonde. <laughs> See, they could have had that as the default color. Well, no, because he's the son or daughter of whoever the fuck. Right, whatever. yeah, geese, uh-huh. Okay, well then, uh, who's blonde? Terry, Rock, and, oh, the, what, what Kevin? Mm-hmm. They could have had Kevin's blonde be a secondary palette, not the main <laughs> one. I'm with you, yeah. Because there's a lot of blonde characters in, uh, like, SF5. I forget. I, th I feel like SF6 it t toned it down a little bit, but... There's, like, a million blonde characters in all these games. They should find more hair colors to use. Mm. Oh, what? See, why does why she do this, this fucking slutty-ass move with her hair, like, when she gets on her knees, bro? That, that's... Wait. That's That's why nobody likes Beach and A, bro, because she's like she's a debaucherous fucking woman. She's just who, like fixing her hair, dude. What the fuck's wrong? She just uh, well, like Mai is a married woman who had a child, you know, settled down. Oh, okay. She's the tra the traditional uh, kind of yeah. character, <laughs> and the Janae is like she's the 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 flapper. She's the one who's like wild. And Party. Well, who's still sailing the seven seas and who isn't? You know, who, who yeah. docked and who didn't? Okay, okay, all right. I got you. <laughs> What's your little kick? Uh, the thing. Mm. Well, that's kind of cool though. The, I like this. <laughs> Watch how I'm gonna kick your shin. <laughs> Also, look at her. Look at her walk forward animation. She like puts her hands behind her head. It's like mm -hmm. kind of a saunter. Like that, 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 that. Also, that is if rough. I mean, if you're some kind of weirdo who's in like armpits, then you probably like that animation a lot. You know. Hey, come here. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why is she sticking her ass when she's blocking, bro? Like, wow. 
She is not a woman of God like my is. <laughs> God. <laughs> I like how the cars and the motorcycles are kind of they're they're sized right for us. It seems like. Yeah. Also, if you or maybe they're a little too big. Look, there's a there's a reflection on the on the window. If you move this way, it, it kind of moves the little light on the car there. Mm. It's tight. It's gorgeous. Well, I don't know, all these colors of these different cars and that fucking Corvette is like distracting, bro. Like, this stage gets a big F in my book. <laughs> if I lose on this stage, it's because the, the background was too distracting. Yeah, I can't see anything. What's happening? Damn it. Oh, oh. Blown the F out, bro. Mm, I like her purple skull. That's cute. That is nice. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> I don't I don't feel like you'd be pouty after you've been knocked the fuck out. I, th I think you'd be on the goddamn ground. Yeah. Oh, I get it now. I get it. The demo is the winner fighting some random person. Yes, yeah, that's that's what's happening. Yep. Okay. How do I play as one of the boss characters? Okay, so go over to either Dong Huan or Jae Hoon and hold start. Don't and so press start. yeah press up up down down up down and then while you're holding it press uh oh damn it yeah press a button there you go yeah old oh, blue devil holy Ooh, shit that's, i like that color that's that's cool versus versus, versus. Dun, dun. Uh, this dude makes me think of well, i don't i don't know if he played soul caliber Four, yeah, I believe it was Soul Calibur Four, and they had one of these big, beefy, stupid final bosses where it's like, I'm the fucking Alpha and Omega, bro, and I'm gonna <laughs> fucking kill everybody, and I yeah. have big hair and big, big muscles and a big sword, and I, I'm, I'm big, I'm awesome. Uh -huh. it's, it's like the lamest shit ever. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah. Watch out, bro. Watch out. Yeah. Oh, oh. You don't want to be in the way when my kick goes off. <laughs> Is there a quick way to pull off that that down up kick thing that you do? Um, the thing. Yeah, it feels like you have to charge it, don't you? You do have to charge it, yeah. Mm. I mean, it's just l learning how to charge efficiently. Uh, is just part of learning how to play a charge character. So, you know, you're you're always charging, you know, when you're doing stuff like this, you're throwing out other moves, like, you can do like this, and you're charging, like, while you're, while you're doing that. So you can do that afterwards and stuff like that. So, it's not, like, it's if you don't play charge characters, it's not, like, um, intuitive immediately. But there's there's tricks you can do for a lot of those characters where it's not as, it, it's not as, like, Prohibitive as it seems, the t the charge time. Mmm, yeah, I'd say it's fucking bullshit, bro. Oh my god. Oh yeah, you think so? Yeah, I hate charge characters. I hate doing Chun Li, and then you have to charge the Hadouken. Mm -hmm. Why does she have to charge her Hadouken, and then Ken and Ryu don't? That's fucking <laughs> sexist. True. True. Grant. His name's fucking Grant. What the <laughs> fuck kind of name for a final boss is that? Yeah, his name should be Grant R. Heinlein. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it'd, be, it'd, be, it'd still be stupid, but it'd be a better name. <laughs> oh, hi, I'm the final boss. I'm, I'm the fucking, <laughs> fucking hell spawn of the underworld. Uh, my name's Kevin. <laughs> How do you do? <laughs> Oh, you're about to get nutted on, bro? Oh, shit. It whiffed. Do your pee on me. Um, okay. Oops. Oh, nut! That's the Raging Storm. That's like Geese's signature super. Um, they. Oh. The motion is just down to forward twice, obviously, in this game, but like in the old games, it was like the most infamous 
difficult motion. It's like down back, half circle back, down forward punch. It's like a really, it's like a pretzel you're you're making on the joystick mm -hmm. to to do the move with the geese most of the time. No, I don't want this one. I'm okay, so go to oh. Jay Hoon and press down, down, up, up, down, up. Oh. oh okay, well, Whoops. next time. <laughs> Big nut. Bye. Hot dog nut. Can't figure out how to. Bullshit, bro. How to break? I think it's. I think it's. I thought rising tackle was his break, but I can't do it. Uh -huh. I feel like Terry shouldn't be in this game because, like, with Rock Howard, mm -hmm. he's, like Terry and Geese are like original X Men, and then. Rock or Rock is like New Mutants or something. Like yeah, the descendants of the original X Men, mm -hmm. like the new kids on the block. Right. And so this could have been that, but I, I guess you could have Terry in here as one hanger on from from the old guard. Yeah, that's that's also kind of why it's viewed as like a uh in the same vein as th Third Strike or sorry Street Fighter Three. Um, because that was supposed to be a passing of the torch kind of thing where they didn't have all the old characters, just like Ryu and Ken or whatever. Mm. They eventually brought a lot back, but, or not a lot back, but some back. Um, but yeah, like, I tell you, like, the, you know, I think it's the only returning character, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, you have, you have Kim's, like, kids who are, are kind of like him, but they're not the same character. Yeah, Hokuto Maru is, I mean, he has, like, some of Andy's moves, but he's not the same. So it is kind of like that. They just had Terry in there because he's like the guy. He's like the the main character guy. But but yeah, you know, if they wanted to go full commit to like passing of the torch, yeah, maybe maybe like in the next one they would take out Terry or whatever. Just leave it leave it to Rock and the rest of the guys. I think it would have been more effective if Ryu was older. Mm in 3, rather than looking the same as he did yeah. in Alpha and 2. <laughs> or I guess you could say, to Ryu time-traveled to the future where everybody's a fucking idiot and none of his, his old buddies are there anymore. <laughs> Maybe. Oh! Damn. Threw his jacket on you. I liked his last one where he sprained his wrist jerking off too hard. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He shakes his hand. Oh, oh. Okay, so here. Yeah, so start down, down, up, up, down, up, and then button. Wait. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there oh, go. oh, shit, shit. There yeah. you go. There you go. Got it. Got kind R Heinlein. <laughs> uh, I think he's a charge character. Um, he's got charge back and then forward punch for a fireball kind of thing. The whole back and then forward punch is one of his moves. And then he's got uh, down, charge down and up and kick is one of his like his anti air kind of thing. Yeah, there you go. Mm. He he looks like he belongs in an '80s music video. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, w would you say charge characters are more predictable because you know they're always holding backwards and they're going to try and pull some bullshit on you? In some way, but also they have, um, I don't know. It doesn't make them like bad. Like there's been really good charge characters. It just depends on how they're designed, really. Like Guile. I mean, he only has like two moves, right, for most of Street Fighter, but he's been really strong and especially in early Street Fighter games just because the strength of like Sonic Boom is normals I mean he had glitches too that helped that you know we're good when you said Sonic Boom it made me think of the Sonic Boom whatever the fuck from Sonic the Hedgehog oh yeah yeah I do, I do think of that too when I hear a Sonic Boom <laughs> it's been ruined forever yeah because of that stupid shit Oh, 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 oh. Do you have any ideas what we'll play next time for this segment? Um, yeah, yeah, I've got a couple ideas. I, I have, I have well, a I list. Guess, well, 
I was gonna say don't spoil it, but you kind of have to for me to download the fucking game. Oh so. yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, just I can just take a glance at it real quick. I mean, I I really want to do Urgates, but that requires like a PS1 emulator with the uh, netplay that works. So that's that's on the back burner. But you're you're familiar with Urgates, right? It's that it's a fighting 3D yeah, fighting game with yeah. like Cloud and Tifa and stuff. Let's worship the fucking map, bro. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, what else? The Street Fighter Three games. I think all of like just like trying all of them would be fun. Hmm. So that that that'd be like a contemporary to this kind of or. Yes. Well, yeah. Did the first one come out. Uh, I mean, I want to say it was like ninety-seven or eight for for the first Street Fighter Three. So that that was right before this, or you know, not too long before this, to be honest. Mm. So well, this would have been in arcades next to a third strike machine, then most likely. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's the most cursed game. <laughs> <in a while. laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny. I think it's the main reason I would I would want to just show it off and just check it out. God, I won. I have to play this fucking idiot again. Dude, he's poggers. He's cool. Bro, he's a fucking 80s pop star. <laughs> Alright, I guess we'll leave it. We'll make this one the last one. Oh, let's, oh, do, I, let's do one more after that. Like, with a, with a, your favorite character or whatever. We can do that too. Mm, I guess one more. I'll do one more with Terry. Okay. Dun, 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 bum, bum, bum. Yeah, you need you need to get that quarter quarter thing though with the little ka -ching. That's a good idea. Going in. I like that idea. Then we could say we we fucking wasted thirty six dollars playing this tonight. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Gato. Gato one. El Gato as in El Biblioteca. My mis, mis pantalones. <laughs> Donde esta mis pantalones? I'm not wearing them. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like charge characters because... Well, this is just me. It's because you're never going to guess what the hell their moves are. Unless you see that, okay, the, the regular motions aren't doing anything. So then it's going to be a charge motion. I guess oh. you would deduce that if you were familiar with fighting games. Mm -hmm. More so than I am. Uh, yeah, kill me. This dude sucks. KO. And he's blonde. Another fucking blonde dude. Oh my god. <laughs> yep. I'll reset it. And then we'll pick our, our favorites. I want to pick Jenny. She's my favorite. Dart. Terry. Hi, I'm Terry. Hey, you want to go grab a couple of drinks? <laughs> Doing the thumb off to the side. Hey, come on! Come, he's like, hey, come on, let's go! Drink some booze. Say something weird like that. Drink some booze. Let's drink some booze. <laughs> Are you okay? Well, she would. She's a pirate. She drinks some booze before the fucking match. Yeah, dude. She's liquored up at all times, dude. See, and she drinks. Alcoholic. Confirmed. <laughs> That's another reason why she's not a woman of God. Yeah. I love when that happens in fighting games. Both people are sent flying in opposite directions. Yeah. Bro, did I just do a feint and I didn't even know it? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> You're learning. Oh, we have to do melee at some point because that is a real fighting game with characters. <laughs> I don't know. I heard Time and Tallarico didn't like it. <laughs> what game did he like besides the ones he was involved with? That's a good question. Did he like Spider Man for Atari 2600? <laughs> Probably. Oh my god, I'm thinking I'm fucking controlling Dijon. God damn it. 
because I liked her too. She she was fun to play with. Yeah, I like her. Fucking gone. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> I like her, the, the the sound she makes when she does the downward kicks. Oh yeah, yeah, I like that too. Yahoo! Yeah. <laughs> oh what? shit, Barbaroi Falls? Oh my god. Yeah. Style Kung Fu? Holy shit. He's a Kung oh, Fu Asian fighter. Asian monk guy does Kung Fu? Like, wow, didn't see that one coming. I know, that's, that's, a, that's a new one for me. Fuck. Oh, I guess I guess I gotta play single player now, Miro. Cause I'm, I'm too good for you. Well, you, we gotta see if you can beat the game. <laughs> Let's see. Can I beat this this one dude? I mean, I beat you, and you're better than the CPU, so I've proven myself. <laughs> well, once you get to once you get to like Grant, like it's it's basically fucking impossible unless you you find like the one exploit that works. Hmm. God damn. Oh damn. Oh, damn, that dude just did a dunk on my ass. Oh my god, is he gonna beat me? <laughs> dude, don't let him... Don't let him win. Don't let him win. Okay, I'll <laughs> sure <to> do that. <laughs> do not let him win, whatever you do. I like how you can move just a little bit after somebody's knocked out. Yeah, yeah. I like that too. They, 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 that take, that, they take that out of, of, of modern games for whatever reason. I don't know why. It makes me think of Soul Calibur when you can ring some, ring out somebody and then ring out yourself. Exactly, yeah. Mm -hmm. I love that stuff. That's my favorite favorite thing to do in those games. Get him. Get his ass. Get him. Live wire, yeah! Oh, yeah. shit. This game's fucking easy. It's for a bunch of fucking babies. <laughs> Fucking catch me outside at City of the Wolves, biatch. Nice. Nice, that was fun. Mm -hmm. What'd you think? I'm, I'm mulling it over in my mind which one was more fun, this or JoJo. Because they were both fun. I think maybe this was easier to understand and mm. didn't have stances and other weird, stupid shit. Mm -hmm. And the, the character... Uh, Jonathan that I liked the most from Jojo was the one that was most like a regular character uh, mm. from, for, that would be like something from from this game so I, I think I like this more than Jojo not that okay. we'll keep up comparing each game to each game to each right game, okay yeah but yeah yeah I like to get your perspective as a newcomer and I like that this was was a four button game that mm. was nice and I like that there wasn't a shitload of characters. There was enough to be interesting yeah. and find somebody you click with, mm -hmm. either their their design or their fighting style. Mm -hmm. I I would give it an A minus. Oh, okay, all right, nice. That's a that's a good grade. All right, excellent. Well, Hell yeah. Thank you for watching, everybody. That was fun. Um, we will plan on a different game, probably. I mean, we might come back to this, you know, uh, at some point, but there's a, there's a lot of games I definitely want to check out, so we'll probably go with something else next time. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, that's all for now. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good one. Hell yeah, yeah, time. I pulled off that Pet Shop Infinite 